What's going on guys? Welcome back to my channel. Today we are doing something different. Um, so whenever I played any kind of game, whether it be a let's play or just multiplayer games, it's always been for my Twitch stream, but today I thought I'd do something different where I record a let's play just for YouTube, and this is my first time doing this actually. Kinda reminds me of like the days in high school where I would just like watch random YouTubers play games that I never got to play myself. I saw this game was recommended by this YouTuber called Lynn that I watch and she said that it was a story based game that was very relatable and had like really beautiful art so I wanted to check it out. Just a chill Friday, I have my tea ready so let's get right into it. Chapter 1 Adult Life Florence Yo, 25 years old me in the morning except I don't get up as early as seven. Oh wait oh okay oh I'm on Twitter do we like or retweet um retweeting someone's couple pictures actually retweeting any other people's photos kind of weird to me. I mean, not that it's like weird weird, but I would never do it because it's like unless I'm in it, it doesn't really make sense for me to retweet it. So yeah, I'm just going to I'm just going to keep liking. If I'm not in them, like why would I retweet it, you know? Oh, wait, the dog. Okay, the dog The dog has more more of a case to be retweeted. I'll I'll give it a retweet. Food? Okay, if it looks really good, I, I would retweet it, actually. Especially if it's like art. Art of food that looks really good. What? Wait, what do these numbers mean? Oh, do it, wait. Oh, I'm- oh, okay, I'm just matching them. So I have an office job that I commute to. Yes, answer your mother. Oh, am I Chinese? I would say don't worry about me. Well, actually I would say both. <laughs> I would say both here too. <laughs> this is actually like my calls with my mom during work because I don't, I don't really like taking family calls during work because I'm like distracted, so. You don't have to find a boyfriend for me. I would never say that, actually. Nothing, just work. I would say both here to my mom. I'm fine. Oh, I'm eating sushi. Damn, I love a pretty mundane life, don't I? This is like every post-grad's nightmare to have a really boring adult life. <laughs> I guess this is why they say this game is relatable, right? I didn't go to bed this early in real life. Chapter 2, Memories. Oh, okay, it's like a storybook. That's cool. Um, I guess I'm kind of a hoarder. Or I discover my memory box. Got some stuffed animals, ticket stubs, diaries. I have really stubby legs. Florence, seven years old. Ooh, okay. Wait. Oh, I'm just like decorating it. Okay. What does the color palette do? Oh! I like the pink one. Alright, that's good enough. Butterfly! Oh, it's mirrored. Okay. The music is really nice. Oh, 
Oh no. Okay, so we have more context here, guys. We have more context. Obviously, I have a tiger mom, Asian tiger mom. She says, fuck your art extracurriculars, you gotta study. I guess since I'm making this video, I should like give my two cents on if I relate to this. And I'm gonna say that I actually don't really relate to this. I mean, my mom has always been like, you should make smart decisions and study and, you know, go for a career that'll make you successful. But she didn't outright be like, you can't have hobbies that won't, you know, support your studies or something like that. She was never like that. I mean, I guess when I was a kid, it was mostly just like all my free time was spent on video games and I spent a lot of time playing video games. But even then, she was never like super strict on get rid of your games or stop playing games so you can go study. I was very much like mature enough to be like, okay, I need to finish my homework and study before I, I play too many video games. Oh, oh, you're trying to test my math skills. I haven't done math in like two years. <laughs> I did go to Kumon though. So your math ain't shit. I'm mad. I'm angsty. I'm clearly an angsty middle schooler right now. Not even middle school, maybe like elementary. Yeah. Oh yeah. They said I was I was like seven, right? Age seven. Oh, I'm Oh no, don't make me do this, man. Fuck this okay, this is relatable. I was, um, I was not very, I didn't really fit in that much in middle school, I'd say. I had a lot of, like, different friend groups, like, every year, and I always felt like I was, like, very nerdy and very much, like, had different interests compared to the other girls. Um, but I did always have my circle. Like, I wasn't a total, like, loner. 18. That's... Oh, oh, wait. I can go back. So from 20 to my mid-20s. I'm like, I look like I work in tech. I commute, obviously. Probably have a decent college degree. I'm surprised I don't have AirPods. I'm actually 25 right now. Does the game know? I'm contemplating my life. Chapter 3, Music. Um, it's the same food picture, so I'm gonna like it instead. Like. 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 My battery's dead. Oh, yes. Let's listen to some real music. Oh, this is so pretty. Yes, be drawn to the music, girl. <gasps> the dreamy cellist. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Act two, Crash. Oh, I don't, I don't like the title of this. Oh, I'm trying to get a, my prescription's fucked. Who dat, who dat?
Oh, no, go back. Yeah. Uh. Oh, I I fell over. I fell over staring at that guy. What the fuck is going on here? <gasps> Bro, you purposely fell, didn't you? Oh, I blush, I blush. Krish. His name is Krish. <gasps> First date already? I'm nervous. I'm clearly nervous. Oh, this is cute. Oh, I gotta... Okay, I can do this, I can do this. I'm not fucking up my first date. If only formulating words on your first date would be this easy. Uh... My first date with my current boyfriend, actually, was, um... <laughs> it was kind of a disaster. Um, I was like really nervous and I had anxiety that day. I'm not even joking, but he like didn't mind at all. All right, all right, all right. Yeah, actually my first date with my current boyfriend right now, um, I was actually the one to like take him out. Like I, I picked the place, um... I was the one who drove because he was from the Bay and he came down to LA. And you know, it doesn't always have to be the girl. I even paid for the dinner. And yeah, it doesn't... To, to all the girls out there, you don't have to always be the one to wait for the guy to take you on a date. You can always be the first one to ask. Actually, he did ask me, but I was the one who like picked everything and... um basically made the plans. This is a cute date spot. I will go here on a first date. You know, it kind of seems like um, it's not too intimate. There's a lot of people around. Good date spot. Go me. Or go him if he picked it out. Wow, this music is so nice. Wait, I'm doing this all in- oh, oh, wait, no, no, no. These are first dates, so I'm not doing this all in one day. Where do I live, though? It kind of looks like the bay. Go out for some drinks. Oh, conversation- <gasps> Oh, so there's less, there's less, uh, pieces, so it, it means that my conversations are getting easier with this guy. With Krish. We getting closer. Talking is easy now, man. Kiss. Oh, look at that! You see that? Easy. <gasps> yes, girl. Act three, dreams. Hmm? Oh. Oh, he's telling me about his life now. How oh, he... He's a cellist. You know, I just uh, have been practicing cello since I was a little kid. I like to perform at the bar on weekends and on Third Street on the weekdays. See the people pass by. I don't know why, but I thought he would not care about fame, but I guess he does. He wants to make it big. Contemplating my life on my commute, because I clearly have no dreams, is what I'm guessing. Oh. 
Oh, girl, you're inspired. You want to be an artist. Yes. Let your mans inspire you. Inspiration. <laughs> Oh, I'm cleaning my room. What else do I need to clean? A door? No. Oh, okay. Ugh, we're on the bed. Blush. Academy of Music. So he never actually went to music school, but he wanted to. Or he wants to. Oh, I'm... You got this, babe. You you got this. You can be a student at the Academy of Music. What do you have to lose? Yes, let us encourage... Let us encourage us to chase our dreams. I feel good about myself because I help my soulmate take the first step. I'm sketching again. I'm sketching again. Wow, I must be pretty good at sketching if this is what people look like in actuality. Chapter 8, Exploration. Um... I wanna- I wanna hit the river area. Wait, what do I do? Oh, I shake it. Art gallery. Sushi? Krish's first sushi. Oh, meeting their family! He has a big family. Krish's music friends. Oh, I'm meeting his friends now, too. Oh, yes. Because what would it be like working in tech and being in your 20s without your forest hikes? Oh, this is cute. I'm so scared of skateboarding. It's like... I'm, I'm really, really uncoordinated when it comes to skateboarding. Aww. Honestly, I would be a little bit embarrassed to have all this up on my work desk, but it's cute. Act 4, groceries. Oh no, are we fighting? I don't like this. Oh no. I don't want to fight, come on. I don't like confrontation. Oh no, my, my dialogue is getting pointier and getting more agitated. I'm starting to make jabs at his words. Oh, oh, no, no, come on, come on, come on, don't let him have the last word. Oh, fuck. Oh, God. No, I won't lose this fight. Come on. Fuck, I lost. <laughs> No, the vibes. Dude, really? Oh, you got it. Yeah. Let's apologize. 
Oh yeah. Fights suck. Yes. Let's just have a nice day of cooking dinner together. Six months. <gasps> We're moving in together? This is this is this is escalating. Alright, so we just hit chapter 10 moving in, and I feel like that's a pretty significant part of our little story here, so I'm just gonna end it here. We'll continue to upload the rest of this game, and yeah, this was fun. Um, thanks guys for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.